Hey everyone, I'm Ellen here at eTrailer.com. Today we're taking a look at the Pacer Performance Hi5 LED Truck Cab Light Kit. Now if you already had your Hi5 or the those five lights on the top of your truck and maybe you just want to replace them out with something that looks a little different with the clear lens or maybe you want to add these to a truck that didn't have them in, in uh to start with, this is going to give you everything you need to get that install done. So we'll get our five lights include, and also the sockets to hold our bulbs. It does come with the LEDs and also the incandescent bulbs if you want to use those as well. Um, typically your LED bulbs are going to be brighter and last longer, so I would probably go with just the LEDs, but it does also come with the incandescents. So it's kind of up to you there. You can also use these in pretty much any other capacity that you'd want. They're going to be a T10-194 style bulb with, of course, that amber color. So if you have any other accessories that uses those bulbs, you got some extra now. So we'll have our wiring. The wire, this is going to connect between all five of our lights, and then we'll quick splice in each of those sockets for the lights. It does have a ground coming right off of that socket as well, so we'll need to find a good grounding spot for each of those. The quick splices do a pretty good job of getting you connected there. The one end of our wiring does have this little spade terminal, so that's going to go on the back of our switch that's included. The other piece of wiring is going to be this fuse and fuse holder also has that spade terminal so that's going to go on the other side of our switch to help protect everything from any shorts so we don't have to worry about blowing our lights we'll just have that fuse that we need to replace uh, if that ever occurs by having the switch included you'll be able to bypass the wiring for your truck so you don't have to worry about tapping into your vehicle's lighting system which can potentially void your warranty if you do that on a newer truck so something to keep in mind there uh, some other customers have said that they wanted to just not utilize this switch and wire it directly into their running lights it's definitely something you can do it's not too hard to do but if you wanted to go that route, you might need a little extra wire to get everything connected. Again, comes with the quick splice connectors for our wiring connections. As far as the lights themselves, it's going to be a lens and then this kind of rubber boot. So this helps to conform to the shape of your roof, whether that's flat or contoured. And it should also keep out water and debris from getting into your vehicle. Uh, we also do get the hardware to get this attached into our truck. So you do have to make some holes into your vehicle if you don't already have a spot to mount these up. That is something to keep in mind there. Um, you will have to do some drilling if you don't already have a mounting hole for these. Now these are styled after the 1988 through 2002 Chevy and GMC factory roof lights. So it's going to give you that factory look. Again, it does have the clear lens with those amber LEDs or amber incandescent bulbs. These are also available with a smoke lens, which is basically the same thing. It's just darker. So it kind of gives you that blacked out look for your truck and also in the traditional just amber colored lights. So you can find both of those here at eTrailer.com if you want to check out those options. I am going to wire this up so we can take a look at what it looks like illuminated. So you just take one of your LEDs. These are basically the same style as the incandescent bulb, so you just push that little wedge into the socket there. And it's a good idea to do this before you get everything mounted because it is polarity sensitive, so I have my power turned on, nothing's happening. Most likely I just need to switch it the other way. So pop that back in there, turn it on, ta-da, now it works. So definitely something you want to do before you actually get everything in place uh, so you're not, ha not having to take everything apart to get that light working. I'm going to turn the light out in the studio so you can get a better idea of what that looks like in the dark. Now, of course, the idea with these lights is not to uh, provide you with any better visibility while you're out on the road. This is kind of to make you more visible to other people out on the road. And I'm sorry I can't show you all five lit up at one time. With my setup, it's just going to be the one guy at a time. So just kind of use your imagination for the other five. But that gives you an idea of how bright that is there. This does work with 12 volt systems. Wiring is pretty easy. Again, we'll have our red power wire. Black with the ring terminal is going to be our ground wire. 
as far as the size of each of our lights. Overall length, if we go to the bottom of this little foot here, it's about five and three quarter inches long by about two and seven eighths or just under three inches wide and then about one and a half inches tall. The mounting holes are about mm, about four inches apart, maybe four and an eighth inch if we go center to center. So if that matches up with your original hardware, that should work out pretty well, but otherwise you might have to make some modifications. If it were me, I would probably grab some silicone sealant for your holes going into the truck. It does come with these little rubber O-rings to go underneath the head of each of those screws to provide some water protection, but you know, you just, you never want any water to get into your truck, so if you can avoid that, it's always better to be safe rather than sorry. So we do have some silicone sealant available here at eTrailer.com if you want to pick that up to go with your light kit. But that's pretty much going to do it for our look at the Pacer Performance Hi5 LED Truck Cab Light Kit. Hope this video has been helpful in deciding if this is going to be the right kit for you. Thanks for watching.